And now people are talking about gender, they're talking about sexual violence, they are talking about the, the problem of rape culture, uh, and that's something that we should be really, really proud of. So you give yourself a huge round of applause because we have started that. Glasgow have shouted back, they've started a global mainstream conversation about rape culture and sexism, and that is an incredible thing to celebrate. your life so far, all the people who have worked until this moment who have been important in your life so far. And then take a second to imagine what your life would be like without those women in it, without the guidance of a mother, without a teacher, without a doctor, without a sister, without an auntie, a grandmother or a friend. Would you be the person that you are today without those women? And now I want you to imagine a future where those women going forward have the ability and the capacity and the right to realise their full potential. Imagine what the world would be like then with everybody having an equal opportunity. And I heard a Japanese plumber recently that I thought really, um, really rang true. And it was, the nail that stands out is the hammered down. I think it's time for us to start being those nails. And we need to keep standing up together so the way and we keep standing for all of our sisters around the world who are not free to stand. So I want to say thank you to every single one of you who came out here tonight, who braved the weather, who didn't know if you were going to be the only person standing in George Square with a placard that you made yourself. And look around you, this is just the beginning and we should be very, very proud of what we've done so far. So well done. We've got 
um, someone who represents the new generation of feminism. I think there's more and more and more young women and men yeah, so. calling themselves yeah, feminists. And it's an absolute inspiration. I think that it's really moving. So many people have turned out tonight. Our next speaker is a young woman, uh, Stella Rooney. She's, gonna, she's a young feminist campaigner from Glasgow. So everyone, Stella. that call 
Um, so thank you so much for coming out tonight. It's so brilliant. It feels brilliant to see you all. Um, and proving that Glasgow knows that if there's not a quality for one of us, there's a quality for none of us. So thank you so much. people chat to new sisters that you've not met before and maybe out of this moment we're going to build a new feminist movement in Scotland that can really tackle sexism in our country. I just want to say thanks very much to everyone for coming again. A couple of us have we've got leaflets from Rape Crisis and we're thinking about going to those bars that were identified as targets. We're going to give out leaflets to these places so if you want to come around Glasgow, give out these leaflets and campaigning against great culture and our bars and our clubs and trying to make our city safe, then join us. I'm feeling like the pressure of introducing and I'm still like, I've got to get up and I'm going like, ah!